Bob Stewart Jew who was a very close friend of mine. And, and you know, I made mention in the lecture the other day that, that if, if you were going to have somebody introduce you to Dave Vernon, you couldn't do better than have it be Charlie Miller. And Charlie Miller is the guy that introduced me also to Stuart Judah. You know, he, he could take a deck of cards and, and just using subtleties, you know, kill you. I lectured several times back in the 50s over in Cincinnati, and Stuart would be sitting in the front row. And I'd do a trick where I did the second deal. And, and, and when I do that, he knew I knew what the trick was. He do when I got to that part, he goes, you know, <laughs> he'd telegraph all over the room. <laughs> I was about to lose it, and he just it just uh, made his blood run cold to, to think of doing moves if he could do a subtlety. You know. And Stuart Judah uh, had inherited his father's uh, estate, and so. He never had a job. He just went every morning down to the brokerage firm and tended to his stocks. One morning he was going down there on a beautiful day like this, and he had to get there like by 8 o'clock. And then he went by a sewing machine shop, and, and you know, he got off the bus and had to walk two blocks. He went by a sewing machine shop, and there was a guy standing in the uh, window of the sewing machine shop cutting a silhouette, which uh, you, there were silhouette cutters, with, a lot of people did that during the Depression. So then he walked back to get, get the bus back home. He went by the same shop, and the guy that had been doing the silhouette cutting, when he went by in the first instance, was standing just kind of fondling a deck of cards. And, and Stuart could tell that by the way that he did this, that he was probably a card magician. And that night, there was an SAM meeting, and one of the members brought a guest. And at the end of the meeting, after everybody performed a card trick or two, uh, the guest got up and said, incidentally, fellas, uh, my guest this evening uh, knows several uh, pretty good card tricks. Why don't we ask him if he'd do a couple of them for us? Uh, Mr. Werner, would you mind doing that? And Dave Vernon did a couple of card tricks where he used push-off doubles, and Stuart said, I gave up magic, that's it, for the rest of my life, I don't want to ever see another magician, I don't want to ever touch a deck of cards, I'm through forever, that's it. <laughs> Stuart used to like cigars, and on hot summer nights back in the 50s, before air conditioning was common, Stuart would come out on the front porch, Start, nuke, start, make, start naked, and light a cigar about this long, six, seven inch long, and light it and smoke it all the way down, sitting on the front porch behind the bushes, you know, that grew up around the edge of it, and uh, enjoy the breezes. Now, I don't know anybody else that ever <laughs> had that experience. <laughs>